Hi Aries, it's Elle here to do a quick reading for you. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It means a lot. Please continue to do so. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's get into it. Thank you God for blessing Aries with a clear, concise message from you. All right, so let's see, we're gonna start. This is a reading only about advice, okay? So it's advice for you. It's advice for love and romance, career and finance, all right? So let's see what the advice is for you in terms of love and romance, all right? First card, listen. So um, be still, be still and listen. Listen to your intuition. Whatever is telling you is true. Uh, whatever it's telling you to do, go do. You know. Um, let's see. Um, you also may be having some vivid dreams, uh, some spiritual downloads, okay, um, in love and romance. Uh, so this might be a time that you need to be directed in on yourself or the energy needs to be directed in on you so that you can get in alignment in terms of your heart and your mind. Because it's like your heart tells you one thing, your mind tells you another. Maybe it, it can even be your mind playing tricks on you and then you're out of control, you're out of alignment. You could feel like somebody is the one, you know, or um, they're the perfect person for you. Okay, you feel like they're a soulmate. You don't know if they feel the same way about you, though, if they are choosing the soulmate journey. The advice here is to choose the soulmate journey. Now, it may be one that, you know, it's not going to come without its trials, its test. It says pull two more cards. All right, let's see. What's going on for Aries? Destruction and God. Okay, so it looks like all of a sudden there's some sudden upheaval, maybe even an event or a fallout or a breakup or some something is unveiled or revealed or um, there's a breakdown. But in that destruction, uh, you see clearly in the rubble, it's kind of like you see the opportunity to either rebuild get on the right page or get in right standing you see the opportunity to have more some of you seeing some um maybe some truths about yourself in terms of relationships and you know and it's causing a bit of uh you know a tower moment like a destructive moment for you to where now you're you're going to get to change something about you you're gonna have more order, more law to how you deal with certain people or love relationships. You're gonna to listen to your spirit guides or you're gonna to listen to some guide. I don't know, you may go to someone who is gonna give you great advice. This could be, past, I heard pastoral care. This could even be, I don't know, this could even be you going to therapy and maybe unpacking some of the issues that you have within yourself. Maybe it could even be you talking about maybe your emotional outbursts, the lack of um, being able to, um, lack of being able to compose yourself, not accurately or correctly express your emotions. There's a, you know, that big ball of fire, you kind of let it, let it go. So it's like some of you trying to get in control of something here. Also, there could be like forgiveness, forgiveness of yourself first, of maybe how you dealt with something or how you deal with people or love relationships. Maybe you say nasty things or you're rude, but that's how you feel in the moment. And it's not how you feel, you know, all together. Let's see, you, you also may be, you know, guided to understand, I don't know, yeah, your destructive nature or how what you do is not conducive to long-term relationship. It is destroying or you have destroyed or you are destructive. Some of you are gonna have to get in control and really unpack and come face to face with maybe your sexual nature or being sexual or promiscuous, not being able to finish, you know, relationships, always new starts. All right, career and finance. 
career in finance. The situation will improve. Okay, so whatever situation you are inquiring about, it's going to improve. That's what the universe wants you to know. You do have a definite yes, because it, we have two yes in this deck and one has the exclamation point and it says yes, 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 a thousand times, whatever you're inquiring about, it is a yes answer. Okay, um, there will be a peaceful resolution. It's not going to be upheaval in your uh, career and finance. You're going to come to some resolve. It's going to be peaceful for all parties. Yeah, it's going to be helpful people or helpful people around you or people want the same thing that you want. People are on your side. Okay, um, within the next few weeks, you may get uh, whatever it is you're looking for, uh, a yes answer, an approval, something of that nature. That's what I have for you, Aries. If it resonates for you, let me know how it resonates for you down in the comments section. We got some really good cards, especially when it comes to career and finance. Love and romance, you might need to unpack some things about yourself, but that's okay. Do the work, move forward, right? Don't stay stuck, stagnant, and continue to do the same thing over and over again, but want change, no. All right, so I know you're not like that, Aries. So anyhow, uh, catch me live every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday night, 9.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And if you're feeling moved to donate to the channel, you could buy me a coffee. Yep, the link is below. It says buy Ella coffee. Um, thanks again, Aries. Take care.